हवा के साथ साथ घटा के संग संग हवा के साथ साथ घटा के संग संग तो साथी चल Hi all welcome to another vlog on our trip to Udupi After visiting the Padukkare and Mattu beach we set off to explore more beaches in Udupi You might have visited a lot of beaches in India having different shades of sand but have you visited a beach which has abundant amount of shells So this video is all about St Mary's Island and Malpe beach from where you can reach the island So here we are at the Malpe beach. We are greeted by our father of a nation, Mahatma Gandhi ji. You have small shacks over here, huts. It's a feeling like Mauritius and Maldives. You see those one, two. And as you can see, it's a lot of crowd. Only happening beach in Udupi. most happening beach in udupi where you have water sports island tour and many more much to enjoyment we have this huts where you can take lot of pics so i look at this part it will look like a run of kutch So we will be going at uh, Saint Mary's Island. The tickets are available here at four hundred rupees per person. So we'll be taking that. The boat is ready also. We can see over there. We'll pay and then we'll go. Uh, island. Island. Four hundred rupees. Boat or come? Price is two fifty. If you want to reach the island in less amount of time and avoid crowd then speedboat is the best option or else you can board the government ferry from Malpe port So finally we are here at the Saint Mary's island getting down from the boat and my beauty lady is also on the island That is the Malpe Port. That is the Malpe Beach. So 20 meters right to this island, to this port. We have one and a half hour to spend over here, and then we'll return back. So we are at the Saint Mary's Island. You are not allowed to carry your luggage, so you have to keep your luggage over here by paying this fee. And then you can take only the belongings that you require. Good initiative of not allowing plastics and food, which keeps the island clean. This should be done at all the beaches. Okay, there's a history of Saint Mary's Island. I'll take a photo. So, in case you have time, you can pause the video over here and read the. history on saint mary's island so important instruction is the ferry uh, starts from 8 am and it continues until 5 pm the history says that this island was found and named by vasco da gama in 1498 after which he proceeded to kozhikode in kerala there is only one stall which serves juices and fresh fruits and since outside food is not allowed on the island 
you are advised to have your food before visiting the island. Another unique thing of this island is the formation of the columnar lava and basaltic rocks which were formed by the subvolcanic activities. It is said that 88 million years ago Madagascar was part of this area after which it got rifted. This island is also known as Coconut Island as it has lot of coconut trees. Exploring the other side of the island. This is the western coast of the island which is a seashell heaven. You are not allowed to swim in this part of the island because the beach is steep and it could be dangerous. Wonderful, wonderful beach. You can spend an entire day on this lonely island. We have been given only one and a half hour. <laughs> The amazing part is walking on this shell. We normally walk on sand, but here we are walking on shell. And the sound it makes feels like you are walking on broken glass. Actually, it is the same. So, this area you have big shells. You see this? You can connect and take it away if you want. Let's spend the rest of the time wandering around the island and clicking scenic photos. Don't forget to comment on the comment section. We love to hear your. Questions.